Hello everyone, this is Teacher Joanna again, and for tonight's lesson, we're going to focus on the word made plus different prepositions. This is actually one of the most confusing topics, so we have to focus on the meanings and the uses of each, okay? So first, we're going to focus on this, the, these ones, okay? So we have like made of, we also have made from, and then we have made with, and also made out of okay so we're gonna focus on four prepositions with made so we have of from with and out of okay but for now let's talk about the ver the word make first okay so ma made okay made is actually a verb okay which is either the simple past form of a verb or the past form of the verb, or the past participle form of the verb. Of course, if that is in, simp in the past form, we use that in simple past tense. Let's make an example. And by the way, of course, when we say made, the meaning is, the meaning is just very easy. Okay, since, since the base form is, ma is make, it means that to form something by putting things together, or you can also say that to cause something to exist or to manufacture. So those are the meanings of make, okay? So let's have an example. For the past, my mother made a dress for me. Okay, so my mother made a dress for me, right? So that is our verb. As you can see there, if that is a verb, that is actually transitive. I talked about that in one of my videos before, so if you have any questions about that, feel free to browse the other videos, okay? So as you can see here, no preposition is needed because it's a transitive verb. So we just have an object after that, which is the dress. And of course, for the VPP, we can use that for a different present perfect, uh, for, for different perfect tenses. One is present perfect, and of course, the other perfect tenses. So let's have an example. My mother has made a dress for me. Okay, yeah, so as you can see here, I use has made, has plus the past participle form of the verb. This is in present perfect tense. Now, if you're going to ask me about the difference between simple past tense and present perfect, you can browse the other videos again. The answer is there. Okay, so let's move on now to the next part. So we're done with made as a verb. Now, the problem is if made is actually like used in passive form and as an adjective, okay, remember, it can be used as an adjective or in passive form, VPP as well, in passive form. So as an adjective, okay, this one, for example, if I say, let's have an example sentence. Mm, the chair is made wood. Is this grammatically correct? No, right? Because here we have actually like the subject, we have the verb, okay, is, and we have the complement made, okay? This is for SVC pattern, made here is an adjective. If that is an adjective, we cannot really put any noun after that, and would is a noun, okay? So we have to convert that into an adverb since this is an adjective. Right? This is also part of my first video. So if you want to check on that, check the video I went to school and I went home and I discussed there the conversion that prepositions can make. So we can add a preposition here. The chair is made of, from, with, or made out of. What do you think? Okay, so let's answer that later on. But we need to have a preposition here. Okay, that's the thing because we cannot add a noun after the word made. Okay, now the problem is actually which preposition we should use. You have to focus on this one. Okay, because this is really confusing. Let's talk first about made of. Okay, so made plus the preposition of. Now, whenever you use made of, the meaning is that okay it is used when the material hasn't remember hasn't been changed in the process of making the product okay remember this hasn't been changed so no change has been made when the product has been made okay so don't forget this one okay let's have an example for example the table in Germain's room is made of wood, 
Okay, so in this case, the table in Jer Jermaine's room is made of wood. Okay, in this case, when you look at the table, you can still see the wood, right? So as you can see, the wood hasn't been changed in the process of making the product. It's still wood. Okay, so that is actually made of. Now, made of, made from is actually like totally different from this. Because when you say made from, it is used when the material is significantly, significantly changed, okay, in the process of making the product. In the process of making the product, okay. So remember this, the, the, the material is significantly changed. Okay, let's have an example. For example, people shouldn't use a lot of paper. Okay, since paper is made from wood, from wood, not food. <laughs> okay, a lot of trees are cut each year. Okay, so as you can see there, made from wood. Paper, as we all know, is made from wood, right? So we use made from if the material has been changed in the process of making it. Now, if we're going to look at the paper, we're not really going to see any wood anymore. We can just see the paper. And like here, if we look at the table, we can actually like still see the wood. So that is the main difference between the two. Okay, right. So let's answer this one. The chair is made blank wood. If you're going to look at the chair, do you think you can still see the wood or it has been changed? Of course, we can still see the wood there. So in that case, we have to use the preposition of. Okay, so that's the thing. Okay, so let's move on now to our next part. Now for number three, we use made with. So we use the preposition with, okay, with the word made, okay? But the meaning here, we only use like made if we talk about used when we refer to ingredients. Ingredient used to make food or drinks, okay? Yeah, so food or drinks. Let's have an example. For example, um, this delicious meal, okay, this delicious meal is made with beef and different vegetables. Okay, so the ingredients are actually like beef and different vegetables. So that is the use of made with. Okay, now, so this is basically for ingredients use. Don't forget that. Now, another one, let's make it more difficult. Let's use the word out of. So made out of, okay, right. Now, when you say made out of, okay, this one focuses on, you have to, to focus on the meaning of this because this one is actually like special, Let's put it down, okay? So when you say like made out of, it means that it means that something, okay, it is just used used if something has been produced or manufactured in an unusual or surprising way. So this is used when you talk about like surprising materials used in a product or in something for example she is wearing a beautiful dress made out of plastic bags okay so in that case of course dresses are not really made out of plastic bags but in that case surprisingly the plastic bag or bags are used to make the the dress so made out of is used in the sentence okay so i hope that it helps if you have any question feel free to comment like 